Hmm, just figuring out what can I do next. I think that we should build a snowman. I've already started. Will you join me? So right here, I've started with a sketch of Olaf from Frozen and Frozen 2. And I sketched his body on my face and chest and neck. And so I want to create an illusion with Olaf. So I'm actually laying my LA Girl White Foundation and I mixed it with the LA Girl White Concealer, the flat concealer, which is my favorite for laying eyeshadows and all. It does really great. It actually looks like paint um, that I can just use it just like this. So what I did is I started to color in his face on my face I've already darkened in his eyes I, you see his row of teeth right there on my neck his black buttons which are made out of coal you know you know how Olaf does you know what he does he's just a joyous little thing so we're gonna make him joyous <laughs> Look at his little big mouth is coming forth. And I'm just making sure right now I'm cleaning up those areas that um, that seem to um, not be as projected but seen. Um, just like his teeth and his mouth and his head. It did look like I had a mustache, right? But those are actually his eyebrows. So, yeah his eyebrows so what i'm doing now if you can see i took my la girl brown foundation it's called chocolate and it actually has like a nice little pleasant smell but it isn't chocolate <laughs> um i don't know what the smell is but it did it did smell really good so i didn't mind having it on my face this time so after i gave it one coat i'm going back in and this time i'm only putting the white concealer on top of it um, I think I gave it maybe one or two squirts of a white foundation by LA girl uh, and I just want to say I don't know what it is LA girl is a very inexpensive brand but it works for me when I do creations like this almost all my creations consist of LA girl um, the white flat concealer so I can lay shadows and just about anything it works well with its own foundation and it did really well um, after I gave it a second go around it became very opaque and very white as you can see and that is this is not just the lighting but it's the product itself so way to go Ellie girl so what I'm doing now and never mind me I like to look at my TV shows while I'm doing this you know, most of the time I'm doing creations and it's late at night, so I can't have it real loud with music and all. Ha, huh? that's okay. Olaf is getting busy, y'all. Do y'all see him coming forth? I do. So what I'm doing is I'm, I'm continuing to make that bright with that second layer. And what I'm doing now is I'm creating him a nose. And I'm using the matte palette from the crayon case, that orange in there. So it's a nice bright orange. So I had to make his carrot nose look like it was kind of pointing towards you. You'll see it afterwards when I'm finished. But look at those eyes. Now what I did is I kind of messed up on them eyes. But I'm going to tell you, when your mind is ready... Stay on top, stay focused, make it work. I made Olaf work. <laughs> so what I'm doing is I'm using my She Matte Liner that I use. I love to use when I like to make bold lines, um, outlines, small lines, dots, what have you. It is perfect for this. Just to make him look a little bit bolder. Um, give him more shape with this little snowman body and face and all. And I had to really be careful because, you know, the neck isn't flat. It likes to move. So 
I had to kind of pause in between so I won't spread or distribute or transfer any kind of color onto the um, the outline of it. So what I'm doing here now is I'm preparing my brows for my total look and I'm using ColourPop foundation. I use it underneath and on top. And so what I'm doing, I'm blending it out with my Glam Supply brushes, my favorite brushes in the world. And so I went right back into that matte book. After I started to uh, prepare my brows, I went in and created a slight cut crease um, with uh, my Tarte concealer and just very slight. And so I went in with that same orange I created with Olaf's nose and I packed that right in the middle because bam, I gotta go overboard. Put some orange glitter in there make the eyes do a little bit of something, put my 25 mm's on. That white underneath there is my chalk dust from the crayon case, my favorite. And then I went in with my on roll highlighter. Baby, look at them cheeks. Please don't mess with it, please don't mess with it. But I'm about to give you a total look. You like it? I do. Talk to them all off.